Let's study pancreas. The pancreas is an elongated gland described as having a head, body, and a tail. The head is an expanded portion that lies in the C-shaped curve of duodenum, where it empties into duodenum by main pancreatic duct. The pancreas performs exocrine and endocrine functions. Pancreatic acinous cells secrete most of the enzymes necessary for digestion and endocrine cells in the islet of Langerhans secrete insulin and glucagon. Let's look at the histological structure. A thin capsule of connective tissue covers the pancreas and sends septa into it, separating the pancreated lobules. The pancreas is a mixed exocrine and endocrine gland. In the left micrograph, the square shows one pancreatic lobule, which consists of exocrine portion and endocrine portion. In the right micrograph, the square shows one islet of Langerhans, the endocrine portion. Exocrine portion, the secretory unit of exocrine pancreas, is the serous acinus. Each acinus contains five to eight pyramidal epithelial cells without male epithelial cells, arranged around a small lumen. Their secretory functions are controlled by eye cells of small intestine. The square shows one serous acinus. The apical portion of the cytoplasm appears strongly acidophilic. The nuclei surrounded by a pale cytoplasm. The double arrow shows belong to central acinal cells that constitute the intraacinal portion of intercalated duct. This is EM of serous cell. The star shows the lumen of the acinus. You may observe numerous cystine of RER near the base of the cell. The Golgi complex is situated at the apical pore of the nucleus. The apical portion of the cytoplasm is full of mature xamogen granules. This is the typical features of the protein secreting cell. The secretory functions of the serous cells are controlled by cholecystokinin, pancreozymin. Serous cells secrete digestive enzymes involved in digesting components of food, including trypsinogen, chemotrypsinogen, amylase, lipids, nucleus. Trypsinogen and chemotrypsinogen are inactive because if they are active in the serous cell, they will cause the self-digestion of the tissue only after being released to the lumen of the small intestine they can be activated by enterokinase secreted by absorptive cells serous cells also secrete trypsin inhibitor which can prevent those two zemogens from being activated this is a balance if the balance is broken the pancreas will be digested and the pancreatitis will be caused. Pancreated duct system includes intercalated duct, intralobular duct, intralobular duct, and pancreated duct. In this paragraph, the single arrow shows the intercalated duct, which is relatively longer. Now let's learn endocrine portion, islet of Langerhans. Endocrine cells of pancreas 
are grouped into small spherical clusters known as islet of Langhans, which secretes hormones to regulate blood glucose. The islets vary in size according to the number of cells present and are rich in fenestrated capillaries. Three main cell types can be distinguished by Mallory Azen staining A cells, B cells, D cells, and PP cells. A cells. A cells constitute 20% of the islet cell population, are relatively large in size, and are usually located at the periphery of the islet. A cells secrete glucagons, which increase the rate of conversion of liver glucagon to glucose, and hence raise blood levels. B cells constitute 70% of the islet cell population and are usually located in the center of the islet. B cells secrete insulin, which acts antagonist Ticloid to glucagon and facilitates the utilization of glucose by increasing glucose oxidation and glycogenesis, thus lowering blood sugar levels. These cells constitute 5% of the islet cell population and are located between A cells and B cells. These cells create Somatostatin, which inhibit the increase of glucagon and insulin. In addition to the above cell types, the islet also contains PP cells, which secrete pancreatic polypeptide involved in inhibition of gastrointestinal motility, secretion of pancreatic juice, and contraction of gallbladder. If the islets of lung hands undergo pathological changes, B cells degenerate and insufficiently secrete insulin, blood sugar will raise and be discharged with the urine, which is called diabetes.